Welcome to another edition of AIN's Gadget Central. Have you ever wanted to look deep inside your airplane or engine and not had the right tool for it? Well, today I'm going to show you this cool, inexpensive tool that lets you do just that. Stay tuned and we'll tell you all about it. So here it is, a depth tech inspection camera. I'd seen airplane mechanics talking about this on Facebook forums, and I looked it up. I got this one at Amazon.com for just over $60. Let's take a look and see what we've got and then hook it up to my phone. Here's the camera. Charging cable. One of the things I like about this inspection camera is it comes with some little add-on tools. One of them is a little magnetic pickup. Another one is a 90 degree mirror for those hard to spot components. This might be good for looking inside the spark plug hole to uh, take a look at the valves. And then there's a hook in case you're trying to fish out something that you dropped deep inside the airplane somewhere. So all you do to use these is you just unscrew the little cap on the end, and then screw on the tool. And the good part about it is you still get to see what you're looking at while you're using the tool. So let's hook this up and uh, look inside this airplane. The first thing I do is start up the Depth Tech app. I've already got it on my phone. After turning on the camera with this button right here, all I do is connect the Wi-Fi network on my phone to the camera's network, and now the camera is displaying right on the telephone. And I can take pictures, I can shoot video, rotation, store the pictures for later. So let's go look inside this airplane, see what we can see. So one of the things we can look at on this Piper Cherokee is the aileron balance weights. I can just stick it right in the hole at the back of the wingtip, and there I can get a good view of the balance weight. I've got some adjustments on the control head here. I can add more light if I want to. That's probably way too much. Or I can even zoom in and zoom back out. One thing to know about this camera is that the focal length is about two and a half inches. So if you get too close, things are gonna start to get blurry but you can still get a fairly good look at things from two and a half inches away. There's a wire inside the cable, so you can bend it to give you different looks. So after bending it, I'll stick it back inside here and see if I can look at more of that balance weight. I could even do a 180 degree bend and stick it back here. Let's see what that looks like. There's a little bit more of the front of the balance weight, and I'll put some more light on it. There we go. I would say this looks pretty good, but I'm gonna take a picture of it just for the records. There we go. Of course, I could always put the 90 degree mirror on the end to get a different look inside there. A lot of times uh, when inspecting an airplane, like for a 100-hour annual inspection, you really want to get inside some of these hard-to-reach areas and see if there's any corrosion in there. It's also a good tool that you could use on a pre-purchase evaluation to see if the airplane has any hidden corrosion. So I'm going to look inside the flap here and see what that looks like. Okay, there's the leading edge of the flap. You can <clears throat> see there's a little bit of uh, surface corrosion on the uh, soft aluminum layer, which is fairly normal for an airplane that's about 50 years old. Uh, let's go down to the bottom and see what we can see there by the trailing edge. And looks fairly clean, actually. 
what I'm finding with this is that there's some places I'm able to look at that normally I could never even spot with a flashlight and mirror. Now, a lot of these old airplanes, the manufacturers didn't think they were going to last this long, and they didn't spray any primer on the interior aluminum parts. So we're seeing a lot more corrosion in these older airplanes, and it's important to be able to look for it. So let's say I want to look under the instrument panel. Normally, I have to get upside down and crawl under there, and it's uh, pretty uncomfortable in some of these small airplanes. With this camera, I'm just going to stick it up there and take a look. Here's a great use for this inspection camera. It's really important to inspect mufflers for wear and for the baffles inside to see if they're coming apart. So all you have to do, just stick it right up the muffler and you can get a perfect view of what's going on inside there. This Depstec inspection camera at only about $60 is a really handy tool and there's no reason it shouldn't be in everybody's toolbox. If you've enjoyed this episode of AIN's Gadget Central, please let us know what other gadgets you'd like us to cover. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching this AIN video. Please like, subscribe, and share it if you've enjoyed it. Also, visit AINonline.com for all the latest on the aviation industry.